guys welcome back to my channel decided to make another interesting video for you regarding me being a buyer this time and having an issue with an order <laughs> from the seller so reverse guys this time reverse situation so basically uh, i ordered um, ebay shipping supplies with my coupon and um, it was shipped by fedex they usually ship it very fast uh, i ordered it a lot of times before um bubble wrap i mean not bubble wrap boxes uh bubble mailers tape whatever uh so basically i get a coupon every three months every quarter to use for 50 dollars so i ordered uh different size boxes from ebay shipping supply store and um it was 10 by 8 by 6 boxes and 12 by 10 by 8 so they shipped them out with fedex same day i think actually when i ordered it and um, usually it takes two days uh, from my past experience sometimes it took three the most depending on holidays of course or week weekends so um i got a message as i usually do when uh, i get some kind of package delivered uh from my ebay purchase or any purchases so i got uh, the message in my email and my ebay uh, that i the package was delivered and usually they deliver it to my door and leave it there they don't there is no signature required so i went uh and checked when i got the message and the, the box wasn't there the package wasn't there uh, so i kind of thought maybe it's possible they delivered it uh, to the wrong spot in my building and I checked over there and it wasn't there either. So I went into FedEx, uh, it was a tracking number, upload, I mean, check the tracking inside of FedEx.com. And um, it actually right now, as you guys know, they actually upload the photo image of the package. I'm not sure if they do it for all the packages, but for uh, as far as I know, for a couple packages before I checked, there was a photo of where it's it has been left, like uh, outside or near the door or like a deck if you have a house. So I checked on the photo and it uh, looked like it wasn't even my uh, like uh, building or like uh, road, <laughs> like uh, where it's supposed to be usually. Like it was not the right image. So I i called fedex and talked to the rep <laughs> ai <laughs> no i'm kidding not not the AI. real person guys so and i explained the situation to make a short story long guys <laughs> or long story short <laughs> but uh they said uh, they will open the case which they usually do and they will have uh their tracking because uh, they have used gps now not just fedex ups usps all of them use um, GPS uh, GPS locator, I guess, uh, and uh, to check, uh, and also will check with the driver who was delivering packages in the area where I live. So uh, they said uh, I will get text message notifications about the process and progress, which I did, uh, and uh, they said it usually takes two days for them to investigate, kind of what happens it's kind of one of their fastest way to get rid of you a little bit <laughs> so two days went by and um, no progress so basically there was no nothing changed in terms of notifications that i got uh, about whereabouts so i have i called ebay uh, and uh, i will actually call them right now also and upload the video for you guys in this particular video when I'm gonna talk to the rep. Um, so I called eBay the first time about it and I said uh, that uh, FedEx delivered the package to the wrong place. So I opened the case uh, for us as, as, a, as a buyer, <laughs> not satisfied buyer guys <laughs> this time. And uh, since I know the process already for many, for many years, it was something that I know how to do. And I opened the not received case for both uh, orders because from 
when I looked at the box that uh, was on a photo in FedEx tracking, looked like they actually used one big box and put both uh, boxes, both size boxes in that big box. I ordered 20 each, so it would fit in a big bigger box. So and I, I know that it was a box because it's eBay on top. You can tell from the photo, and that's what usually happens. They deliver it, and I, like I said before, it never were any issues before. I ordered many times from the eBay shipping supplies, always delivered. On time and no issues uh, left it at the right place <laughs> so for eBay to explain uh i opened the case uh online in ebay for not received uh package uh, and um, then i called ebay also using the um, help and contact guys i'll show you i'll share the screen where it's located so you guys if you have similar situation i'll show you the cases both cases that i already opened and I'll show you the place where uh, you can actually call. Um, I mean, eBay will call you. So let me share the screen and I'll show you first both not received cases. So that's the first one that you guys going to see um, on your screen. Uh, that one is for 10 by 8 by 6 boxes. And uh, you can tell uh, basically it says in seller's message right here that's the last message that seller left thank you for your reply in response to, to your inquiry after checking our rec records fedex is currently reviewing the claim to determine the G gps coordinates guys <laughs> artificial intelligence <laughs> and we'll be speaking with the driver to see where the package was left as we receive additional updates in the coming days we will pass them along to you through this message chain Thank you for the opportunity to assist with the issue. We hope this information is useful and apologize for any inconvenience caused by the delay in receiving your order. So and then they, it says, hello, FedEx customer. We received your information and we will begin a review process. And then there is a tracking number, ship date, which was October 5th, and a case number. And so thank you for shipping with FedEx. If you have any questions, please consult our online resources for support. Sincerely, FedEx Cargo Claims. Sure. See the, the name of the service manager and eBay shipping supplies. So it was really nice, nicely worded, guys. Very professional. So basically, uh, it was like a chain of communication between me and uh, inside of the case uh, from last week. So when I spoke to eBay rep actually about the situation last week, they told me if they're not going to close the case in my favor, to give me refund along with uh, refund for my coupon code which was fifty dollars since i already know most likely uh it's been already uh, i think seven days when i called so it was it's been a week so so far the package hasn't arrived yet still so what i'm gonna do right now also let me show you guys so that was the first case and uh let me share the screen again and I'll sh I'll sa I'll show you um, the second one, which is basically the same thing, guys. So I'll just share the screen basically where you can uh, use to contact eBay. I mean, for them to contact you back. So let me share that screen so you guys can see. And um, let me see where it's uh, where it's at, guys. Just a second. Here it is. So basically you go to the screen i got here when uh i was choosing home help and support the returns and refunds returning items and uh it took me here you you can get to that screen from different uh type of um, situations in terms of what you want to call about even choose different one they will still call you back and uh, after that you will see right here it says on the bottom contact us you're gonna have a screen open up and um, basically, it's, it's going to be an artificial intelligence, guys, <laughs> talking with you in the beginning. So you're going to type in, uh, have customer service call me back. And then they will probably pull out. See, it says, uh, it's, well, before that said, hi, Roman, I'm an eBay automated assistant. I can help you resolve any buying. So you, you guys most likely will have the same thing all of you whoever will try to do that from that particular screen 
and uh, I typed in uh, to assist on to artificial intelligence have customer service call me back I didn't say please guys which is very impolite so I don't I don't know if artificial intelligence li like that kind of response <laughs> so okay before I connect you with an agent please tell me what you need help with so I will uh, type in package I was not delivered since I was a buyer a buyer or you can uh, you can either put your case number like open case and then see it's gonna pull up uh bought items and sold items so um it's gonna be uh bought items so in your case since uh, i i'm a buyer in this case it's gonna bring both screens up sold items that you sold as a seller that you want to talk about or bought items that you sold, uh, bought as a buyer so I, saw, I select all bought items and that it will bring up those uh, boxes so then i will basically select either one either the ones 10 by 8 by 6 or 12 it doesn't matter so yeah it says checking on assistant artificial cell intelligence so checking on it and it's gonna bring up this uh i select a 10 by 8 by 6 order and the uh, assistant it looks like you'll need to contact an agent for this and then i'll click contact agent and um after that uh it's gonna come up do you need help with how to check the status of your request and um you say uh something else after that and then uh you can select see it's gonna bring up those screens constantly you can do it either way but it doesn't matter guys um so after that i will select another screen like buying and uh, one of the options will be drive and um, after that it's gonna sync <laughs> for another five minutes <laughs> and then uh it's gonna come up is this the item you need, you need help with which is 10 by 8 by 6 boxes and say yes so after that it's gonna come up again okay roman you can contact an agent report an item that hasn't arrived or track it so i want to contact an agent so i clicked on contact an agent and now you're gonna have the screen come up where you can either chat with an agent estimated wait on one minute or see it says sure i can help connect you with an agent let me know which option you prefer so you select either chat or have us call you back so guys i will call them and record it and also upload it in this video and i will talk to them about uh they because when i spoke to the to an agent the first time uh i told them about the whole situation and um they said if i don't get the package and the case is still open to call them back uh on uh 14th actually october 14th so it was two days ago today's 16th so i will call right now record it and see if i'm gonna get a refund most likely i hope guys i'm a unsatisfied buyer this time <laughs> so we're gonna reverse the roles well, i'll be unsatisfied buyer calling about the seller the seller is not bad guys you know it's not their fault that fedex delivered it to the wrong place as you guys understand many of you who have been either buyers or sellers had similar situations where, where package was not delivered and hasn't arrived on time so it's not uh, in my opinion it's not either seller or buyer's fault but you have to take an action anyway and uh, i will call ebay and um, i will talk to them about it so let me do that right now and i will record it for you guys and you will see it so i'll see you soon guys <laughs> okay guys ebay is calling let me answer hello, hello? yes okay. yes roman landsberg Yes, I'm calling regarding uh, the order that I hasn't I haven't received, and I called about it uh, to you guys. Uh, I think on uh, let me see last week, on uh, most likely Tuesday of last week, uh, and I can give you the actual 
uh, order now. I mean, the, the, I opened the case. I ordered basically there are two orders, and uh, each of the orders have different order number. And this was coming from eBay shipping supplies, so it was actually coming from you guys in terms of your shipping supplies. And uh, I opened uh, the cases and both orders, and I can give you the order numbers or request ID if you would like. But this, would you? Uh, would you like me to give you a request ID? Yes, please. Roman, Roman, sorry. There's another one. Maybe. Okay, let me just check it here. And. So, uh, please, please. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this was for. This one was. Uh, both of them were for eBay boxes. And uh, one is for 12 by 10 by 8 boxes. Uh, and the other one is for 10 by 8 by 6 boxes. And uh, you will be able to see basically from FedEx and from your... I, when I called uh, last time and spoke with one of your reps, he told me basically to call you back if I haven't received any refund. And he said to call you on actually on the uh, 14th. And I actually didn't have time on the 14th. So I I decided to call today because I, on the 14th, I was still hoping maybe they will find the package and they will deliver it, but I still haven't uh, received it. So if you're going to be able to check, uh, you can check FedEx tracking number and you will be able to see what I'm talking about. And I spoke with your rep about the situation last week and I told them that uh, they delivered it, uh, the FedEx, not you guys. But FedEx delivered it to the wrong place. And uh, I got a message from the seller, which is eBay Shipping Supplies, customer service manager, uh, that uh, uh, they basically spoke with FedEx. And uh, they were trying to determine the GPS coordinates of the package where it was left. But it was uh, last week. And nothing happened. I still uh, didn't receive the package. So I will need you guys to kind of help me with a step in and uh, refund me for um, the both for both purchases because I had a coupon which I used for fifty dollars, which I get with my eBay store every three months. So I used that fifty dollar coupon on on that purchase, and then I had to pay extra. Uh, I think thirty dollars or twenty something dollars extra on top of the coupon to buy those boxes. So and it's like I said, it's been already over a week, and I I still haven't received it. And uh, FedEx didn't uh, uh, actually FedEx uh, got back to me last week uh, because I had a case also with FedEx that they opened for me, and uh, they already closed the case and said that uh, they. Yeah, I mean, they didn't find the package. I mean, they do. I mean, they didn't uh, deliver it, and they had to close the case because they completed uh, their research. So they actually have completed their investigation already last week, and uh, that's why I need you guys to step in uh, and uh, refund me because uh, one of uh, the reps that I spoke with last week he said to call you guys back. And you guys will refund me the coupon and uh, also the rest of the money that I spent. Okay, let me just go ahead and check this here for you, okay? We're talking with this dog that 12 inch uh, boxes black logo, is that correct? From eBay? Yes. The other one? 12. So 12. Yes, yeah, the ones were 12 by 10 by 8. There were 20 boxes or 25, I think. And uh, the other one was 10 by 8. 10 by 8 by 6, correct. So there were uh, 25 boxes each, supposed to be 25 boxes, 12 by 10 by 8, and 25 boxes, 10 by 8 by 6. Mm -hmm. So that's why I used $50 coupon, and uh, the rest of the amount was uh, $30. Uh, plus, plus $30 for the rest because it was not enough 
to cover the coupon was not enough to cover uh both both purchases so uh when i spoke to your rep uh, he said that uh, they will refund me the coupon or actually they will uh, ref not refund me the coupon but they will return the coupon back because i want to order the boxes actually and use the same coupon or different so, now uh, so you use the coupon to buy these boxes Correct. Yes, and plus, like you will be able to see on your end that uh, there was thirty dollars thirty four cents. Uh, yes, and then the forty three dollars and seventy one cents. And the coupon, the right? Exactly. Well, the one order was thirty dollars sixty eight cents for ten by eight by six, and the other order was uh, forty three dollars seventy one cents for twelve by ten by eight. So minus coupon which was 50 dollars uh the total for the order was 74 dollars 39 cents so shipping uh, was free and uh Q i used the coupon for 50 so it was minus 50 dollars so the total uh that i had to pay was 30 dollars 34 cents for the re basically the rest because the coupon was 50. so that's what i was uh, talking to your rep about that you guys uh, need to refund me the coupon which was fifty dollars plus uh, the rest of the amount that I spent thirty dollars thirty four cents. Okay, let me just go ahead and check this here for you. Okay, uh, Roman, as for this, uh, maybe this is going on just to further investigate this. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. Yes. All right. Thank you so much for that. Okay. Uh, So guys, we're gonna, you just heard me spoke to that rap, so they're gonna do, they will investigate it more, guys, apparently, to see what happened. <laughs> Sorry, guys, it's probably not gonna be a, a short video, but just want you to see the process, because uh, as you guys understand, most likely I got a rap that's not in the United States right now, because uh, most likely you won't get one either. Um, and uh, if something goes wrong, guys, I will ask for the manager. Let me actually turn the volume down so you guys don't hear that eBay famous uh, rap music. <laughs> for dance music. Famous eBay legendary music, guys. So we'll see, guys, how it's going to go right now. Hopefully it's interesting for you guys. Uh, interesting content. <laughs> I decided that every time something interesting will happen, I will make a video about it. Unedited sometimes. And we'll, we'll see. Maybe I'll edit it a little bit. <laughs> we'll see. But yeah, that's uh, that's a story currently. So you just heard. They. I hope she understood <laughs> what is happening. <laughs> when she went to investigate it more, guys. <laughs> so we'll see. It's a not never-ending, never-ending saga, guys, with issues. It's not like a, you know major problem. It's just I wanted you guys to uh, see. Uh, yes, just a second. Hello? Yes. Alright. So, if I'm checking here, Roman, uh, I can give you the, um, I can give you the refund with regards to the item which is the 12 times 10 boxes block logo since it's already passed uh, 7 to 10 days. So, I will be, thank you for your Frederick, let me just check it here. Oh, just bear with me and start checking it here, okay? Just to verify things. Yes, uh, it's actually both. Uh, you you were talking about 12 by 10 by 8 and 10 by 8 by 6, so both uh, boxes. Mm -hmm. So, but as for this, uh, Roman, I can just uh, send you a ribbon with a uh, 10 by uh, 12 by 10. But for the uh, other item, I hope you extend your patience and try to contact with the seller with regards to this. And then if the seller doesn't respond, you contact eBay for the options that we can do here in my end. But uh, this was contact actually, uh, I'm sorry, this was actually same or I mean, it's the uh, same box. They put it in the same box. They didn't, they didn't separate 
uh, the 12 by 10 by 8 boxes separately and shipped them separately. They shipped it as one order. So they were shipped together in the same box. You can talk to your manager and they will tell you the same thing because this is actually coming from you guys. It's eBay shipping supplies. So this was this was the order where they used the same big box and put both orders in one big box. So that's why, like I told you, that I need a refund on my coupon and also refund on the rest of the amount. Do you under? I mean, if you don't understand, I'll, I can talk to your manager and explain. Because uh, I see, see, I called a couple times and I was kind of, you know, uh, last time I talked to them, they reassured me they're going to refund me my coupon and they will refund me the rest of the amount because I have to use the coupon and it's not my fault that FedEx has lost the package. Mm -hmm. But with regards to this other one, uh, I can uh, Okay, let me just check it here. Yeah. 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 Maybe this is going for one to two minutes again, Roman. Just to check it here. But with regards to this, I can send you the refund. Sorry, it's a way. With a 12 times box. Uh, I can send you the refund with that. But with regards to the coupon, I will transfer you to someone that can, uh, can send your refund with that because it's uh, limited on my access. Yes, please. I would like that because, like I said, I don't want to keep calling and uh, bother you guys about the situation because, I mean, it uh, it has to be resolved. I mean, it, it's not like, uh, you know, I'm playing games. But with this item, uh, the first one that I told you, I can send you a refund or uh, I can send you a refund yeah. for the moment. Okay. Right. Okay, okay. I'll send you the refund right now, okay? Okay. You will be receiving it 24 to 4, I mean, 3 to 5 business days for that. But with regards to, to the coupon that you wanted, I'll transfer you to someone. Let me just check it here. But this is the item I did, right? Mm -hmm. Yes, please transfer me and I'll explain to them what's going on also. Let me just check it here, okay? Okay. With me. No problem. Okay, just a moment. Is it an eBay gift card coupon? Yes, eBay coupon is uh, every three months I get eBay coupon for $50. It's uh, it's because when you have eBay store, uh, you you get specific amount depending on what type of store you have. So in my case, I get fifty dollars each uh, every three months for my store to use on to use for shipping supplies, which you actually it, it's coming from eBay shipping supplies. So it's actually it's coming from you guys. Let me just check it here, okay? Okay. I'll just finish up. Okay, please bear with me. Okay. Okay. Whisper with me, okay? Yes. Yes. <laughs> you see what's happening? Yeah. 
when you call other countries for support. Moments, please. You get a lot of moments, guys. Oh, and for this uh, moment, I can uh, make this is call on her for one to two minutes. Okay, please. Just for, all right, thank you so much for that. Okay. Okay, guys, we're back. <laughs> To eBay, famous music again because I got I got to the wrong country this time. I have to... Guys, I guess eBay doesn't know that they use uh, coupons for sellers, <laughs> especially uh, apparently this customer service web. But uh, you have to be polite anyway, guys. Um, sometimes it takes amount of time because you have to explain to them that you use. Uh, sorry, let me put the music down. You have to explain to them that you use, uh, you have a coupon every three months to use for eBay store. It's never happened to me. That's why I wanted to make this video for you guys. We have this kind of situation occur. I, I, I'm, I'm probably thinking that it's a very rare situation that someone ordered eBay shipping supplies as they were not delivered to you or just uh, lost or dropped off at the wrong place. I don't know. It's a very unusual situation. So I just wanted to make this video for you guys. So it, talking to eBay about it and you guys can hear I was just talking to the trap I mean but be polite of course I mean it's important I mean it's not her fault I mean it's uh, not even when you call FedEx customer service reps it's not their fault it's basically local delivery FedEx that I have here messed it up so unfortunately they can be it's a difficult job for them they have to answer the phones constantly by like buyers especially can you imagine last how many buyers that have issues they have to go through every day it's a headache so i understand that it's not like i wasn't like cruel or anything you know i'm just by saying i'm not playing games it's just sometimes i mean um, um it's just uh, the way i talk usually it's not uh, something you can you, it's not really impolite but uh, looking for the specialist here for you. Please bear with me, okay? Okay. I'm uh, still looking for someone. All right. Thank you so much for that. Okay. Yeah. She apparently she is looking for someone. Apparently manager. Uh, usually, if you ask for upper management, they may transfer you to support in here in in the United States. And I think it would have been better, in my opinion. You can re leave comments uh, if you if you the whole situation occurs. It's easier to resolve it, I think, if you explain it properly in the way it happened. I mean, they eBay usually will be on the buyer's side, as you guys know. In those cases, when package gets lost, they will refund both parties most of the time. So we'll most likely, but since it's eBay shipping supplies, they will basically it's coming from their warehouse from eBay. So they will refund you anyway, the leads that cost. And uh, I'm just basically want to get my coupon back that I can use it again right now because uh, I need the boxes. With fourth quarter, guys, <laughs> fourth quarter coming up. And uh, that's why uh, the first time ever it happened to me, I've been ordering uh, from eBay with a coupon for many years. And uh, that's the first time they lost the package or delivered to, to, to the wrong place um so we'll see uh, what the response will be right now with upper upper management guys <laughs> to call like different locations to find the manager because they're very busy but uh yeah it's nothing i mean against customer service rep or any country where they have reps at i mean they do their best job they can I mean, those types of things occur every time. It's not like a big, huge deal. It's just the uh, subject itself is kind of interesting for you guys. Thank you so much. Uh, thank you for patiently waiting. I'm still waiting. Uh, I'm still looking for someone that can help you with regards to the refund of the coupon, okay? Okay, very good. All right. So please bear with me. I'm still looking for something. Okay, thank you. May I please just go on for one to two minutes again, uh, Roman? Yes. All right, thank you so much for that. Yes. <laughs> Getting 
Kjo pa më bëke e njëzë. Ta e rëtë së të kullë gëjës. I just want to make this video for you guys. Maybe beginner, beginner, it's resellers, eBay. How to actually, they call you back and show you a little bit. Because I actually forgot to show you the next screen on... I'll show it to you when I'm done with the conversation. Because there is a next screen when you select have us call you back. It's gonna have the next screen come up with your like phone number. For them to call you back because most of the phone numbers that you registered with in your eBay account they will call that number. So make sure to <laughs> make sure to actually have that phone number because if you don't, some people have a couple of different accounts, so they may have different phone number in there. So they will have um, they will select have us call you back, but they have a different phone number in there, so they will call but <laughs> on a different phone. <laughs> Since you already uh, tried to, you know, uh, pay, uh, you got for paying this item, we cannot take over it anymore. Which one? Hello? Yes. What are you talking about? With the coupon that you wanted for a refund. But with regards with the other item, I already sent you yes. a, uh, a refund with that. But on the other case here, I'm, well, you, you, what I'm, t I'm trying to explain to you that uh, that fifty dollar, fifty dollar coupon is actually provided by eBay, so it's actually yeah. it's it's given to the sellers uh, that mm -hmm. use the coupon every three months to buy shipping mm -hmm. supplies. So the, what I want to have is I want to have a coupon that I can use again to buy shipping supplies for fifty dollars, because mm -hmm. since I. Since I already used it, I cannot use it anymore. Since it's been already used, you can check with anyone in your department. Oh, yes. You cannot use your coupon two times if you already used it. So mm -hmm. since FedEx lost the package and I already used the coupon for $50, I need to have a different coupon in my account so I can use it again this month. As, as for that, Iron Man. Actually, for that coupon, we, uh, you know, you know the policy that every three months was the one that eBay gives that. So since you already um, received the coupon from us, so you still need to wait after three months again for us to give you a coupon because um, it's our here in a policy that we give sellers um, coupon every three months. I understand, but I I used I used the coupon on the boxes. And I never received it. So how will I, I? I mean, I need to have another coupon. Can I speak to your manager or transfer me to a manager? Because I mean, this is kind of a situation. It's not your fault. But, you know, I need to have my coupon so I can use it again. Like not the same one, but I need to have the coupon back because it was a FedEx problem and FedEx fault that they lost the package. So the package never got to me. So the coupon was used. But uh, since uh, it was not fulfilled, the order was not fulfilled by eBay shipping supply, since the FedEx lost it, I need to have the coupon returned. I mean, not the same coupon, but I need to have uh, at least $50 given back to me in some kind of refund also, plus my, co my other expense that I paid over that coupon. I know that you refunded me the other difference, but I need to have $50 of my coupon back because it's not uh, fair. I mean, I need to use it again since I need to order boxes and you guys provide that $50 coupon. Do you, do you understand? Do, if I, I, I can talk to your manager if you would like uh, to transfer me to your manager and I'll explain the situation because since the order was not delivered, I, I, and I used $50 coupon uh, for nothing, basically. It's like uh, it went up in the air and I cannot use it anymore because uh, I can use it every only three every three months. eBay uh, provides me with a coupon. So uh, since that coupon was not properly fulfilled, since the order was not delivered, it's a $50 loss uh, for me because I cannot use the coupon anymore. And it's not my fault because uh, FedEx lost the package. Uh, 
do you do you do you understand what i'm talking about i mean i'm i'm kind of i'm kind of trying to be kind of nice and stuff but it's not fair because you know i need to still use the coupon right now for to order boxes again Well, you you need. Uh, do you do you uh, can you transfer it to a manager so I can talk to someone in management because this is uh, ridiculous. I mean, it's uh, if FedEx uh, will not refund me for this because re FedEx, uh, you guys have to actually f uh, do that on your end because uh, the seller the seller is you guys. So eBay shipping supplies is actually you guys. You are the seller. So you guys actually send it with fedex and you actually should have i mean it's not your fault that fedex lost it it's just a matter of me explaining to your manager about the whole situation because i think you kind of understand it but you cannot do anything about it because you uh, if i speak to your manager he'll understand what i'm talking about because see 50 dollar coupon is given every three months to the sellers or but like i think most mostly to the sellers not the buyers actually the buyers too sorry um and uh, and the 50 dollars coupon was used for the purchase which was never delivered uh, to the buyer so i'm as a buyer did not receive the package so that 50 dollars coupon basically disappeared with me not getting my order you know it's uh, it's not fair for me as a buyer uh since i didn't get the order to get i mean not to get another coupon code in my account to use for this uh, three months because it was uh, end of uh september so end of september guys it's another three months i have to wait until end of december to use a new coupon which you guys are gonna provide so that's not fair as for me as a buyer and having my store and paying you guys for my store subscription and then i used my coupon and the order wasn't delivered so i don't have my coupon right now do you understand that's why i need i mean i i understand you're doing your job but i mean it's not fair to me as a buyer that i cannot use a 50 dollar coupon anymore on the purchase of your boxes or you because the boxes are from you guys it's eBay, eBay shipping supplies. It's your store. All right. Uh, thank you uh, for that uh, reminder. Uh, let me just document here and send you to my supervisor and manager here for you, okay? Okay. okay for with me. Thank All you. Right. Almost done here, okay? Yes. Yes. Hear what I was talking about. Maybe disagree, guys. Leave the comments. It's, it's going to be a longer video, but this is a headache. Uh, and that's going to be something that I haven't seen a video about, about this kind of situation yet so far. But we'll see how what's going to happen. You see, they don't want to uh, return back my coupon uh, for $50. And uh, see, I have to wait another three months now. And that was that coupon that I used, and they didn't deliver the package. Basically, fifty dollar coupon is lost now, as what she was saying. Cannot uh, give it back to me. So we'll see what the manager says. I hope they will, guys. Here, okay? Here, okay? With me, Roman. Yes. So we'll see, guys. I mean, it's kind of ridiculous. I mean, I'm kind of getting a little bit angry. As a buyer. Okay, uh, we're we'll looking at you for a uh, specialist here now, okay? So please bear with me. Okay. I'll put this call on hold, okay? While I'm locating for someone. Okay. Uh, for my manager. Okay. All right, thank you so much. Thank you. Cannot even locate the manager, guys. <laughs> need to make a video on uh, how difficult it is to provide customer service, guys. I'm kind of.
I'm always peaceful kind of guest, but then I, I kind of, you know, when it comes to the point, because I did customer service in the past, I know it's difficult on the phone talking to customers, having issues, you know, it's not easy, not, not just with eBay, with all the industries. And uh, that's what it takes sometimes. I mean, you have to try to, I mean, get to the manager if there is an issue that, that uh, a regular customer service rep, they don't have that ability, I think. We'll see, maybe. Because the thing is, if they're going to transfer me right now to that uh, manager in another country, most likely it's not going to happen, I think. Uh, I don't know if I can ask him to transfer me to the customer service in the United States, but... Um, I hope they will. I will try. If that's gonna be from another country, I mean, but most likely it's gonna be from another country. So, um, it just uh, shows the regular occurrences uh, from buyer's perspective, as you guys can see now, on certain things. Even though, if it wasn't, uh, she already refunded me, as you heard, for the rest of the order which I paid with my credit card. Uh, but the coupon now is an issue because see, that's why kind of interesting for you guys to see how that's gonna be handled now with actual coupon for the store that I have a subscription and every three months I get that uh, coupon I think with basic store you get certain amount with premium I have a premium store so I get uh, fifty dollars every three months so we'll see if they're gonna uh, put the coupon back for me I don't know Cannot guarantee it, guys. Hi, Roman. Hi, Roman. Yeah. Thank you for being yes. waiting. I'm still uh, talking and, um, you know, looking for a specialist here for you or for my manager. Okay? Okay. With me. Okay. All right. All right. Thank you so much thank for you. that. <laughs> guys, it's going to be probably 12, 12 hour video like my life. <laughs> yes, yeah, see? The, the hassle that either e e sellers and buyers go through the eBay, that's tough life, guys. <laughs> I think if it would have been a regular purchase, they would have refunded it already, the whole amount. It's just, uh, it's kind of interesting. I wanted to kind of understand, in this case, with a coupon, if it's possible. But uh, it's going to be kind of topic for the reseller community, guys, to see if uh, we're going to have some comments on this situation. And my uh, my misbehavior again, guys, talking to customer service people. But at least I'm gonna get uh, try to get to the bottom of it, guys. For you, for the audience. So we we'll go we'll go through it, guys, together. <laughs> we'll see what's gonna happen. I don't know if I will edit uh, certain. I will edit certain things, but uh, or try to. I don't think I need to. Uh, it's just let's see. If, we, if we're gonna get to the bottom of it, yes. Hope, hopefully. It's a very unusual uh, situation when I was thinking about it and how they can reimburse you for the coupons. The only, they, I think they cannot put it back into your... Maybe they can. I'm pretty sure they can put a, another coupon, $50 coupon for the buyer to, for their shipping supplies. I don't think there is an issue. Or they can send me a refund of fifty dollars more <laughs> in a regular way to use, but I don't think it's gonna happen. I have a, I have my doubts, guys. My opinion. Talking over the music all the time, guys. I'm sorry. Mother Roman, thank you for patiently waiting. Yes. I'm looking for a special here for you, so please bear with me. Okay. While I, all right. Thank you so much for that, Roman. Okay. Guys, locating specialist <laughs> or manager ain't easy. <laughs> I think I think you may have some issues with people uh, getting work there. Employees, <laughs> probably one manager for like per million people, guys, <laughs> in the world. I don't know. It's. It's not really like, you know, like I said, it's not a huge deal. I just want to kind of understand what happens in a case like that. Many, If any of you guys had similar situation with eBay shipping supplies not being delivered uh, or lost, if you ever had a situation where you had to call back and get reimbursement on your coupon. Oh, hi, Robert. Uh, thank you for patiently waiting. 
think so. I have seen on the other line from our leadership team. So for the rest of you with regarding with this, uh, with your concern, okay? Yes, thank you. You so both have a great day. All right, thank you so much for that. Thank Bye you. Bye for now. Bye. I remember my assistance. Yes. The previous representative explained to me what happened, but can you tell me more about this? How can it be a Yes, uh, yes. Well, well, here's the situation. I ordered, um, I have a premium store. So every three months, I get $50 coupon to use for eBay shipping supplies. So I ordered uh, eBay shipping supplies. There were two orders. One order was for 12 by 10 by 8 boxes, 25 each, uh, 25 boxes. And then the other order was for 10 by 8 by 6 boxes also 25 each so ebay shipping supplies which is basically ebay uh they provide you with a uh, i mean if you have a premium store i get uh, every three months i get a coupon to use for 50 dollars. so i went ahead and i paid partially with my coupon which i had every which i get every three months which was 50 dollars, and then the rest i paid with my credit card and the order total uh, was $74.39 uh, minus coupon, which was $50, uh, which was from eBay that I get. Uh, and then the rest of the order was $30.34, which was on my credit card. So I was trying to explain to the rep that since FedEx lost the package of the, that was only, uh, the package basically consisted uh because i looked at the fedex photo uh of the place where they apparently left the box it usually consists when they ship like like if i order boxes from ebay shipping supplies they will put like both box sets both 12 by 10 by 8 and 10 by 8 by 6 boxes in the same big box so they ship them in a big box both both orders and and that particular box got um, uh lost by fedex and i called already last week and talked to fedex i talked to one of your reps and they told me as the first rep i, I spoke with he i explained that since i used 50 dollar coupon on the boxes uh and the fedex lost it it's not my fault as a buyer that they lost the package and since they still haven't found the package and i, I actually had fedex do a research and investigation because they had a case open also on my behalf about this uh, package and tracking and they closed the case already last week so they already completed their investigation and they haven't found the box and they apparently sent the driver i don't know what they did so i was trying to explain to the rep just now that i talked before you that since i use the coupon that i get every three months for 50 dollars i need to have that coupon returned uh, or different coupon put back into my account so I can use it again because I cannot wait another three months till the end of December to use new coupon and uh, since it's not my fault as a buyer in this case that FedEx lost the package or delivered it to a wrong address uh, it's not my fault and uh, that's why she actually told me she gonna refund me I mean eBay will refund me the amount of which i paid extra with my credit card but they she says she doesn't know how to uh refund my coupon back which i used for 50 dollars because now i don't if i go into my uh, uh marketing and promotions actually marketing subscriber discounts if i go to marketing subscriber discounts and see and click on ebay shipping supplies uh see details it has uh uh basically coupons there right now that is uh already been used uh since i i don't know if if you guys can see it on your end or not um let me go here uh i don't know if you guys can tell me if that coupon because there is a coupon currently there right now which is under coupon uh window but i'm not sure if that coupon is actually valid right now since uh, like i said 
uh, use the coupon for this um, period for um, for this uh, last I mean for the quarter that I get for the September actually October November December so and then end of December I get another one so I don't know if you can check if that particular coupon is still because I currently have one and I don't know if that's a usable coupon that I can still use right now. Yeah, thank you so much for letting me know about this, Roman. And to let you know, actually, for this one, your seller is the one issuing you the coupon, right? Not eBay. The seller's username is eBay Shipping Supply. Correct. But it actually is, yes. And your seller is actually the one issuing you the coupon. So for this one, I would highly suggest that you communicate with your seller regarding this one. Because there will be no option for us to process a coupon that was issued by your seller. Okay, so basically, but you, uh, from your uh, perspective in terms of uh, right now, since it's the eBay shipping supplies, is it possible mm -hmm. that I speak with to someone from their department? Because, I mean, it is eBay shipping supplies, so it's uh, associated with your, uh, with uh, eBay. So it's not like... Uh, Uh, well, for this one, Roman, actually, you're speaking to the correct department. So upon checking uh, this shop, actually, it's a specific seller, but it's not eBay itself. So we don't have a specific department that you can talk to because this is actually a seller on eBay. But I could definitely say that it's not your fault. Okay, it's not, nothing of this specific issue was your fault. And you definitely receive a full refund for this. And uh, your seller should definitely issue a refund for the coupon as well. They have all the rights to do that. And you can definitely go ahead and contact them. So that is the best resolution that we can give you because there will be no option for us to process our coupon because your seller is the one who actually processed that coupon for you. Okay. What about the amount that I paid with my credit card, which was $30.34? Because when I spoke to your rep just now, she said that they have reissued the refund for that amount already. Yes, you will be refunded. That's actually right. You will be refunded with that amount. So since it was close today, you shall receive a confirmation shortly after this call. You can check your eBay messages. Actually, uh, we have already sent you a confirmation regarding this. So, yep, you will be refunded for that a specific amount that you paid for using your credit card and it will reflect back within the next eight to five business days and as for the coupon you can go ahead and definitely message the seller and we will also notify your seller as well okay great uh, appreciate your help mm -hmm. but you were really helpful uh thank you for listening to me about the problem i appreciate your help and giving me refund for that rest of the amount and i will try to actually message but the case uh, currently, the case is still open in eBay for both transactions because I can see that uh, both item not received cases are still opened up currently in my window. They, the cases themselves, I mean, they uh, you guys gonna be able to close it, uh, or you I have to wait for for the cases to be closed. One case has already been closed. You can definitely check your eBay messages because, as I've mentioned, it was already refunded. Okay. So both right now, mm -hmm. currently, the cases that I have currently for both orders, uh, I can still uh, message the seller, uh, which I probably yes, can. Definitely. Yeah, I know that I can. I just uh, wanted to double check. And uh, okay. Uh, <laughs> of course. Yeah. Okay. That's not. You will also notify your seller after you message them. Okay. And can I? I will tell. I will message the seller, and I basically tell him that I spoke with you already today about the situation mm -hmm. and uh, about the coupon. Yes, of course, you can do that. All right. Okay. I appreciate your help. Have a great uh, day. You too. Is there anything else, your man? Uh, no. I appreciate right. appreciate your help. You're very much welcome, and since we have addressed your concern, we can now tag this contact as resolved. And um, bye-bye for now. Thank you for choosing eBay. Take care, Roman. Take care. Bye. Okay, guys. Sorry it took 10,000 hours like my usual lives, but as uh, they refunded me already. Uh, let me see. 
I'll show you guys. So they refunded me for the rest of the amount that I paid with my credit card for thirty dollars thirty four cents. You see, so your refund is on its way. Um, so I will call. Actually, not call. I'll message the seller in the item not received case and uh, see if what we can do about coupon. Because as you just heard, so learning experience, guys. As you just heard, um, they don't uh, associate with eBay shipping supplies because uh, apparently I thought it actually was eBay, but it is kind of weird because it's eBay shipping supplies. So I guess it's a separate entity that they have, which most likely it is, and it was. So I'll have to message the seller and uh, see if I can get the coupon back. But yeah, the refund for the rest of the amount already was processed. So I got the refund for that uh, for $30 that I used extra on top of coupon. Uh, so that's good. Uh, but yeah, guys, that's the thing about it, about this whole situation. Is that um, you just heard me talking to them and uh, how long it took because of unusual how it, unusual situation is. If it was a regular product that you purchased on eBay and it was lost, most likely eBay would have refunded you anyway um, and uh, would have um, refunded the seller or just the seller would have kept the money also because it's FedEx fault. Um, but it's sometimes it's kind of it's different in all types of scenarios. It depends. But um, hopefully it wasn't boring for you guys. Uh, like I said, I was checking to see uh, if uh, there is a. I wanted to actually show you that other screen. Um, just a second. Let me share the screen with you again, and uh, so you can see the where i got to the screen to for them to call me so what it looks like uh here you go um here are these guys so on the right side on the bottom you're probably gonna see it says uh, it says great an agent will call you and then there is a phone number they crossed out the numbers except my last two number two numbers and area code so in about two minutes to see how we can best assist you. So that's what I was talking about. Is that um, um, they have to have the proper phone number. So if you have a different one and you currently have like, if you have two accounts on eBay, for example, you may have different phone numbers associated with both accounts. So you can have one account on one phone number, another account on another. So just make sure you have the proper phone number because they'll call you back on a different phone number and you don't, you're not going to have a call i mean you you will basically kind of be confused where they're calling so make sure to double check which phone number because you can tell by your last two numbers of your phone number if that's a proper number for you for them to call you uh, because uh, sometimes it happens you know like people will have different phone number in there and they will call and that's going to be different phone number and you're not going to get the call the other phone will <laughs> so, um so that's basically it, guys. Um, sorry it took a long time, but uh, I really appreciate you all watching this uh, particular video and me being on a hold with eBay. And I will try to get to the bottom of the... The case is still open, as you guys uh, heard me talking to her on the phone. The case is still opened in terms of the item not received case. They still haven't closed it. Even though they just refunded me the partial amount, I mean the amount that I spent on my card, but uh, coupon basically is gonna is kind of up in the air right now. So I'll see if I can uh, get the coupon returned to me and see if I can get it back from the seller from eBay shipping supplies. I don't know if I will, but hopefully I will. I, apparently they are the only ones that can return your coupon back to use again, different coupon in this case maybe they had similar situations most likely they did so but anyway. okay guys here is a conclusion of the whole situation i decided to just uh, record it in the same video so uh, i just actually found out uh, that um, ebay shipping supplies is a little bit different entity 
from actual eBay, which I kind of thought maybe uh, they're kind of associated in a way, but it's not uh, the department that actually is uh, in the eBay itself. Like uh, it's a different entity. It's like a seller on their own. So you just uh, for the future reference, uh, eBay shipping supplies where you get your boxes and shipping supplies using your coupon every three months it's a separate entity of ebay let me put it this way so they actually provide their own support and they if there are any issues like with mine with my situation they will take care of it on the end uh, if you go through the uh, case when the case is opened and you send messages back and forth uh, regarding the, the case so they are very professional in terms of that and uh, so basically just wanted to clear that out and uh second part which is most important for me i got my 50 dollar coupon uh, back so i can still use it so that was uh, basically the situation that i wanted to finish with uh, so I got refund for I got a refund for uh, partial amount that I spent using my card, and I got my uh, coupon uh, back. Not the same coupon, but different. But still, I can use it again uh, if I want to today. So it was really nice. And uh, yeah, sorry, it was a long video. Uh, I tried to make it uh, like as descriptive as possible in a way so you see the process of me calling ebay and talking to them and discussing the problem so that was kind of important to finally figure out how the actual situation works even for me understanding it because i never ran into this kind of issue with uh, ordering ebay shipping supplies uh, from the ebay shipping supply store using my coupon and them uh, losing the box I mean not them but FedEx so now I have a clear understanding of that the entity which is not basically same with eBay even though the eBay shipping supply store so it's different uh, so just for you guys to know in the for future if you run into this kind of issue and they will uh, reimburse the coupon if that's gonna be the case where some where their package with shipping supplies gets lost so just to be clear so once again guys thanks for watching <laughs> and i'll see you in the next video stay safe take care